hi guys welcome back to my youtube channel it's really dealing with me and um, i'm fighting it but today um 2022 january It just came up again like i thought it was it has reduced but it, it came up this afternoon again like the old feel of this postpartum it just came up again and the, the, i don't know how i feel i don't know how, what i'm feeling like so much discomfort so much you know I'm really I'm really fighting this but I think that I think at the end of the day it's really getting to me and I try to do something one or two things in, at home to see if this thing will go away but I think it's still there like today it came up from like 30 to 45 and 45 I thought it has all gone last time when I posted that video about depression why why feeding uh, my baby but today it came again like like hundred and ten percent and I feel very weird. I feel different. I don't have appetite. I I just want to drink a lot of water and uh, I feel I feel like right now I'm losing. I'm losing for what I don't know. My no, my husband keep asking me, Are you okay? Are you okay? He's just a wonderful husband to me, like always check it checking up on me to know if I'm okay and so they said just relax yourself sleep let me take care of the baby but you know as a mother there's this connection you have with your newborn and even though when it's with her I'm in the parlor I'm, I'm seeing a movie or any other thing I just want to go and check up on them you understand they might she might be wanting something as a man is his first child they might not know but me at least I'm seeing one or two things I might know but this post but none is really getting to me in the sense that um i just move into this uh, state and i really don't know anybody yet i'm trying to know one or two persons i have great neighbors around me you know but this always indoors and i don't want to cry so far this tiktok tiktok app I've, I've, been, I've been helping me in the sense of i'm doing videos and the rest um tiktok and whatsapp status i just post and everything but it just makes me feel as if time is going on this is that's how i feel right now it's as if time is leaving you you're, you're slacking you're going back and i usually get hot when someone says something to me even though the thing they are saying to me is not bad it just makes me feel as if I'm hurt. And I noticed something. When I'm breastfeeding my baby and she's like I'm sitting down and I'm breastfeeding her, like the this depression and everything comes. But I noticed something um this afternoon. When she's lying down and I'm also lying there and I'm breastfeeding her, we are both lying down. I don't feel any symptom of depression. I don't feel no postpartum. I don't feel anything. I feel all right. So I want to know why is it like that? Lying down and breastfeeding her, I'm okay, no depression, I'm fine. I, I could be pressing my phone at the same time. But when I'm sitting upright and breastfeeding her, this oh, they just keep rushing and keep rushing in and... You know, sometimes I wish my mom was here. It's just so hard being a first-time mom. And, you know, when I was pregnant, I used to come on YouTube, see women talking about postpartum. Like, why would that kind of thing happen to me? Like, giving birth is like, is a joy. It's something of joy. You have to be happy. You have to, you know, looking at your baby and everything. Like, I keep people saying, well, like, I don't understand. Why would you feel depressed? Why would you feel all that when you are, you're, you're seeing your baby, a beautiful um, baby? And now it's happening to me. I, I can, like, understand why those women were going through all the stress and everything. And I 
just want to say thank thank you to my husband because he has been a lot of a help to me like sometimes you're like babe let's go out let's go out and like no i don't want to go out and he forced me to go out and come back it's really really hard Uh, after going career, she was with the dad. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You know, sometimes the kids they do help when they are smiling, they are playing, shouting, or making all those noises, and it just leaves you somehow. But today one is really, really high. But the day is getting to an end. I thank God I'm really fighting it. And I'm only been screaming, shouting, like a music drum in my ears. and. Um, I love my baby so much and I don't want to feel the way I'm feeling towards her because it's not her fault. I'm happy having her and she's an amazing child and I love her so much. I love her so much. Yum yum. Thank you for being with me. Mommy loves you so much. So, today was high, but Roger process, I'm getting there. I think what I, I have I spoken to my doctor, they gave me one or two, you know, drugs and um, what to do. So far, the best person I can fight put a uh, postpartum is yourself. You just have to fight it because there is nothing. The voice in your ear and everything telling you to do wrong. <laughs> It's crazy sometimes you feel like a mad person trust me you feel like a mad person like talking to yourself and everything yeah mm. well, i need to go I breastfeed I'm on a lot too much first time mom I don't know when to stop when she's crying I'll just give her the breast when she's not crying I still give her the breast mm. yeah. Mm. yeah bye guys we need to go thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe